Researchers at Northern Arizona University think that they found a drug combination that could help those who are battling COVID-19. It is a big step considering treatments for the virus have been hard to come by. Team 12's Colleen Sakura is looking at what the scientists have learned. In this biosafety level three lab, researchers at NIU are testing different therapies against COVID-19. We don't handle patients in the clinic but we're really trying to fight the good fight. So far, publishing their success on a drug called Stenoparib right now is going through clinical trials to treat ovarian cancer, but Todd French, director of the COVID-19 testing center at NAU, says they're finding success with COVID too. It acts on the host cell rather than the virus itself. Having the best results, combining it with remdesivir, which is already approved by the FDA to treat COVID. They synergize, yeah. The combined effect is greater than the individual effects. French says the two work together, so when COVID-19 enters a cell, remdesivir helps stop it from multiplying. Stenoparib does that too, but it also helps stop the virus from getting into the cell in the first place. Hitting two very different mechanisms to inhibit the virus. Next, they'll be testing Stenoparib against variants seen popping up across the globe, including the UK, South African, and Brazilian variants. There's no reason to suspect that it, it won't be equally effective against those. Absolutely no reason, but we have to test that. Researchers say the drug could possibly be used in the clinical setting in the next few months. It's a step toward hope of more treatments being available to help those with COVID-19. It would be nice to have choices and and they're coming. Colleen Sikora, 12 News. Colleen, thanks.